this is Ray from the city of Lakewood. Today I'm going to show you five drills uh, that you can do at home for soccer. Uh, drill number one, uh, real simple, we're going to do some toe taps. You put one foot on the ball and then you're just going to alternate feet. So it looks like this. Now, um, the purpose of this is to get comfortable feeling the ball. So once uh, you kind of got a feel for it, you're going to want to increase speed and then you're just going to keep it right here. The idea is the ball doesn't really move and you're just laying your foot on top of the ball. That's drill number one. For drill number two, we're going to do some side to sides. So right now we're just going to have the ball right uh, in between our feet and we're going to hit the ball in between our feet. We want to use the insides of our shoes um, and keep that ball centered. So it looks something like this. Now again, as you um, get a, comfortable with the ball, you want to increase your pace. So something like this. All right, so part B, uh, this second drill side to side. Uh, you can use a cone, you have one, or you can use anything like a sock, uh, anything that you can put on the ground. So what we're gonna do for this side to side is we're gonna advance forward. So we're gonna hit the ball like we did on our side to side with the inside of our foot, around the cone, and then we're gonna come back uh, this way. So it'll be two, two hits, uh, and then you're gonna wanna alternate your feet. So left to right, and then you can do right to left. Again, you wanna use that toe tap to stop the ball. So right, left. And the idea here is that you're only stepping once. Uh, when you hit it. So if I start the drill, go left, go right, stop the ball, go right, left, and then just keep alternating. All right, so that's part B of drill number two. So for drill number three, we're gonna go combine the toe taps and side to side. So we're gonna do a, a side hit, toe tap, then we're gonna hit it back, and then we're gonna do a toe tap to stop, stop the ball. So it should look like this. And again, as you get comfortable, you're gonna to wanna to increase the speed. All right, so for drill number four, we're working on some feints. Uh, these are useful in soccer to get open, um, especially when you have someone defending you. So for the first one, you go feint right, and then you're gonna hit the ball left. So the idea is you're tricking them, that you're going right, but you're actually taking the ball left. So again, you go over the ball, go left, and then you can do that, fake left, go right. The closer you, your foot goes to the ball, and the more you sell this, it seems like you're gonna take your body in the ball this way. So it's really important to really sell this, and then hit slowly, um, to your left and explode out of there. So uh, this is fake right and fake left for drill number four. Go left and then left to right. All right, so for drill number five, we're gonna do some pullbacks. So the idea here is you're gonna uh, toe tap or just put your foot on top of the ball. You're gonna pull the ball backwards so it goes behind you. You're gonna step and then you're gonna uh, put your foot on the ball again. And then bring it back, foot on it, just like this. Uh, we can change foot to your left and pull it back. Um, and again, as with all these drills, you wanna increase speed uh, once you get comfortable with the drill itself. So it should look something like this. Um, and then you're going to want to increase your speed as fast as you can. So there are your five drills uh, for at-home soccer. Thanks.